So this isn't one of my normal videos. So my videos usually come out on a Wednesday and a Sunday. And this is not Wednesday or Sunday. But the reason why I'm doing this video is that I have new neighbors. And they need to sell their house in Porto. And I offered to put their house... <laughs> like a video of the house that they're selling in Porto for any of you who are interested in buying a property near the coast in Portugal, obviously in the Porto area. If you're not interested in looking at property in Portugal, then Sunday will be my regular vlog video. So this is not replacing Sunday's video. This is an extra bonus. So this house was built with lots of love and it was supposed to be the house for the rest of their lives. But the opportunity arose to move to the countryside to the farm next to mine. So they moved into this house in Porto in March 2019 and it has a seven years manufacturer's warranty. So it's still got more than five years since so practically new. It's located in Gondomar on a plot that is 690 square meters. It's two minutes from the center of Gondomar and 10 minutes from Porto, obviously by car. It will take much longer if you're going to walk. And it has lots of sun exposure and a spectacular view. So this is a two-story house that's 125 square meters altogether. It's built um, from wood. And upstairs there are two bedrooms and a full bathroom. Downstairs there's a laundry, a kitchen, a pantry, a dining room, living room service bathroom also an office that could be used as a bedroom it's got four solar panels of 250 watts each it's got a very efficient thermodynamic system for water heating it's got an energy certificate uh, b and they're going to sell it fully furnished and with the equipped kitchen so they not what what you see in these pictures is exactly what you're going to be getting and then outside they've got another mobile wooden house of 23 square meters that has a bathroom a shower toilet wash basin that at the moment they're using as a gym they've got four dog kennels a special fenced yard for dogs another a division they use as a storage room. They have two kitchen uh, kitchen coops, two chicken coops, lots of different fruit trees, and a fenced area where they have a vegetable garden. So it feels like they're living in the country, but seriously, only ten minutes away from Porto. So the price they're asking is 350,000 euros, which they believe is a really good price because you're getting this virtually new, only two-year-old um, wooden house and you're going to get all the furniture, all the kitchen stuff, all the appliances everything i don't think the dogs will be coming with it i'm not too sure about the chickens but the infrastructure is definitely there this house has been really well maintained and as you can see is move in ready all you have to do if you buy this house is pack your suitcase jump on a plane and fly to Porto. That's literally all you have to do. 
You don't have to take anything with you. You can take photos of your loved ones, I suppose. But otherwise, you don't have to take anything because everything is going to be there for you. And Porto is a beautiful city. So, you know what? This is a win-win all the way. So, if you want more information, the just email me. Um, I'll put my email in the description below and I can put you in touch with uh, the lovely Christina who is selling this property. So, um, they don't have an agent, so you will be able to contact them directly when I give you their contact details. So, if you're wanting to move to Portugal, don't waste any time. The time is now. So if you are interested in finding out more about um, their lovely house in Porto, I'll put their um, email address. In fact, no, it might be better. Email me. I'll put my email address there. And if you're interested, 
I will email me and I will then give you their email address rather than me putting their email address out for spammy people who might I'm not saying you're a spammer that's not what I'm saying but people do spam you when your email address is out there so I'll put my email address email me uh, if you are interested in their property in Porto and enjoy their house and I'll see you on Sunday for a great chock-a-block full installment of all the goings on at Bella Pedra. Atologo, which is Portuguese for see you later.